I'm going through my first round of chemo. And when I was discussing that with my doctor and the possibility of going through a clinical trial, I had some apprehension. But my doctor here and the staff here helped me to understand that chemo and clinical trials is just another weapon. I was diagnosed with leiomyosarcoma. I've had 15 surgeries and three rounds of radiation and there's no known cure. Cancer is uh, many, many different diseases. We use one word to describe over 200 different types of diseases. So in order to learn, you had to follow millions of people. And the only way can, you can do that is through creating partnerships and asking as many patients as possible, can we learn from you? And so we came up with this concept of total cancer care. It's not just finding the right treatment for the right patient. It's also engaging with the patient, making them feel welcome. When a patient uh, is actually participating and developing the fund of knowledge that's going to uh, enhance our ability to cure cancer, you can tell that patients are proud. When you're inspired by a caregiver or a doctor that says, hey, you know, we have these other tools to use. You know, if this fails, then we can do this. There's hope. There's hope there's that inspiration that gives you that drive to want to fight. There is never a time that I've left here feeling discouraged. Patients at Moffitt actually are invited to create their own uh, personalized medical health record in what we call the patient portal in our database. And so they're already introduced to the concept in their own environment. And that's much more soothing than being in a hospital with so much going on and so much decision making. This advice came from our patient advocacy group, that patients know what they want, or they gradually discover what they want, and they're willing to tell you. I'm blessed to be here 15 years later that we could even have this conversation. So if there's any little way that I can help, either by telling my story or donating some blood or some tissue, that's, that's my responsibility. That's the way I look at it. Our idea was develop technology, develop an approach, and export it to, the, to the, where the patient lives. I would hope that anybody anywhere in the United States, no matter where they are, rural, urban, whatever, would have access to this sort of uh, capability. And the whole idea is the more we can learn from every patient, the more we have to give to future patients. It all fits together, and it's all dedicated for one purpose, and that's to fight cancer. Not, not to remove an appendix or fix a broken leg, but to, to fight a real battle for the patient.